Well, the heat can be dangerous, especially when temperatures reach the 90s or even triple digits. Meteorologist Caitlin Harvey explains how heat exhaustion happens in our Weather Now Extra. It's starting to feel a lot like summer and as temperatures increase, so does our risk for heat related illness. So let's take a look at some of the signs and symptoms of both heat stroke and heat exhaustion. We'll start with heat exhaustion, which is the less serious of the two. You'll start to feel faint or dizzy, noticing that excessive sweating with muscle cramps also possible. To treat heat exhaustion, get to a cool place, drink water, sip on it if you can, or take a cool shower, use a cold compress. Now, what is life-threatening heat stroke? And this happens if heat exhaustion is not treated. You'll notice a throbbing headache, no sweating, and red, hot, dry skin. You also may lose consciousness. Since heat stroke is life-threatening, if you notice any of these signs or symptoms, call 911 and seek medical attention immediately. It's important to remember, this is not just possible for you, but your pets as well. Back to you.